Welcome to the 2023 Persimmon Hill Lake Enid, Mississippi Rally. Rally. That's a mouthful. Yep. So we are here once again. Barbara and Dennis Lee are doing the rally, doing a great job. And um, this is our setup. I don't know how many, oh, I don't know how many people are here. Well, I don't know. Let's see. She makes us these booklets. She makes these booklets and in here is the itinerary and a list of everybody who's here so okay we're back <laughs> okay so i was right there's there's close to 30 people here right 20, 28 people and um so what we're going to do is we're going to show you our campsite but so what's really popular is we've done videos before like show what the rally going on at the rally and things like that this time we're going to try to see if we can find some people that will show us the inside of their campers right so we'll start with ours although first we need to say that last night we had a get together underneath a little pavilion that's right here and she always has a craft for us so last night was the craft and um, I took a clip so we'll put that right here so yeah we we stayed up there till about nine o'clock something like that so had a fire and then uh we had a little rain last night so things are a little soggy here yeah so, hey uh quickly let's take a look at our setup and then we'll take a look around so we just got up so things are a little disheveled in here but you, as you you've seen our setup before we have a little television a little heater in here this thing here on the roof is a folding table that actually clips up there and we can set it up here like a tv tray in our bed and if the weather's bad we can um we can use that uh, we sleep what you'll hear me refer to east and west so that's the way some people go north and south if they're taller we sleep east and west on our bed and our frame is made out of just out of conduit and maker pipe connectors so uh, it's pretty stable and it uh, works really well and then uh, you can see up there we have the uh, EcoFlow River uh, battery pack and um, we use that to power the camper when we're off grid and you can see our setup here in the toilet and such as that uh, on the outside we're we've got a very different setups depending on what we're going to be doing but uh, for this for this weekend we just got the ARB awning and a tarp stretched up there mainly to keep the water from, the, from blowing but we do have or the rain from blowing in but we do have a hanging tent that we can put in here and quite frankly we just didn't want to mess with it today so we got that let's take a walk and see what okay we hey guys we are with terry and pam um pam didn't want to be on camera so we're <laughs> <laughs> it's just going to be me and terry so hey, hey. oh we almost had a little yeah we did we almost had a confrontation here between yeah, dogs yeah. um so we met them at turkey run state park uh this winter and uh just kind of ran into each other so it was yeah. kind of fun so um they've got a really unique setup here what year's your range runner it's a 21. okay so yeah. it's a 21 it has the one piece roof which i really like and uh, they've got a really nice setup now uh, they are a little taller and so a lot of people have asked about uh sleeping you know nancy and i sleep east to west and they sleep north to south yes. in their runaway so i think i'll show it to you but um what do you like about the runaway the best well, well I, the easy to, to tow, uh -huh. and and I don't mind setting up all the stuff that you have to have, but I like the fact that it's easy to tow, and I can get in and out of tight spaces real easy. Mm -hmm. I had a big one before, and I didn't like dealing with some of the things with a bigger camper, so we've taken it clear across the United States. I love it. it it's just a great thing. So. so we've spent some time chatting up with them. We've got a lot of things in common, so it's been a lot of fun talking to them. Let me show you. He's got a couple different mods in here that I want to show you that I think you're really interested. But yeah. let me uh, let me take you inside his camper. So they set up. Uh, they have the ARB awning just like we do. Uh, but he puts a canopy over the top of it. He jokingly calls it his circus tent. Uh, but uh, it he's they got a really nice setup here. And one of the things I wanted to show everybody is that he took his hanging tent and he had a uh, Amish canvas maker actually make this these snaps and th so they they cut this out 
and they've got this right around their door. This is really, this is really awesome. And then the guy went and added on to the tent an area for the spare tire, for the tire to fit over. So it, uh, they were concerned that they didn't have the same color material, but I think it looks awesome. So they can really make this thing very tight on, um, on water. So like he said, they've been all out to Utah on that and they've, they've got a, just a great setup. I think you guys really like it. So, all right, let me open this door because you're going to be, you're going to be just blown away at what he's done in here so hey look at this thing their inside of their camper is amazing so look at here they have two separate beds here and i am really impressed with this thing so much that i may consider doing this myself so they are doing uh north to south here and they have a back door but uh they have this all set up north to south and then they've got the little section there for their porta potty and then if you see this footstool over here uh because terry's slightly taller they just pull that footstool at the end of their bed just so his feet can hang off on that but wow really impressed i think it looks really nice and uh so much so i may steal this idea i really like it uh, let's let's move around to the back and I'll show you from there you can see here This is their back door and this is what it looks like from the back. So you can see their their wood frames that they've built there and man this Very impressive. I really like this so you can see they got a power strip back there and Very impressive. I really like it. So for those of you that are a little taller, this is something you might want to consider. Um, I think it really works okay, out great. Okay, you know these guys. This is who we talk about all the time, Eminem, Maureen, Maureen and Miguel. Miguel. Mm -hmm. And we are here at their setup because they have this awesome... Outdoor... I call them an easy up, but there's no easy about putting it up. But it's awesome <laughs> little tent and we've needed it this mm -hmm. weekend because we've had Lots nothing rain. but rain, rain and mud. So, so they Ed's going to take you on a tour. Yeah, they have a range runner. And what year is yours? So 20, 2020. Yep. 2020. So let's take a look at that. They've got it fixed up really cute and we really like their outdoor living area. So inside they have an easy up with a hanging tent inside of it. And um, this works really good on weather days where it's uh, raining or just a little bit cool. So you can see they've got their kitchen stove all set up out here, their refrigerator, and they just they just hang out out here. Let me turn the camera around and you can take a look. So they've got uh, their table and their stove, and then they've got a uh, an Alpacool refrigerator, and uh, they've got their chairs set up out here. And then if you walk outside here, they have just their camper set up next next to it um, so it gives them some space to be outdoors and where they can camp and see they got the they got the back door on their camper and um, they, they got a good start on their sticker collection too so okay so we're gonna take a peek inside here they've got it cook, uh, fixed up really cute uh, got their mirror and so it's really neat here. They've, they're they using the LED lighting too, and they've got their bed up on a raised platform. But um, it's nice and cozy for them. They use electric heat, and uh, they also have a, a dehumidifier in here too. So um, they we've been showing you some different uh, bed configurations, and so they sleep uh, east and west like Nancy and I do in ours. Um, they're about the same height as we are, but... Um, yeah, it's a, it's a really nice setup. I really like how clean it looks and how how simple they've got everything with their designs and that. It's really nice. We're just laughing because it's like 60 degrees and raining and Miguel is in shorts. <laughs> he's saying he's freezing. He's, yeah. he's cold. And he's complaining that he's cold. I'm like, okay, buddy. I know how to fix that for you. That's so right. that's their camper. Uh, we have a special connection to these folks because... Uh, they started watching our YouTube channel from the get-go, right? Got, yeah, yeah. Pretty, pretty and they got really hooked on trying to uh, uh, get themselves a runaway camper. And I remember the day they got their camper. Well, out. they came so, over mm -hmm. to the one rally to 
to meet us. Yeah. Yep. If it wasn't for Ed and Nancy, we wouldn't be doing this right now. Oh. So, <laughs> seriously. Ooh, I hope you like it. <laughs> we do. <laughs> we do. Uh, Don't curse us. No, no, it's no, fun. No. They, they're, uh, they're just, I say, kind of getting started in this lifestyle, but yep. you guys yeah. have been at it for a year and a half now, two maybe two years? About two, a little over two years. Yeah, a little over yeah. two years. So, so. they're, they're yeah, in full yeah. swing now. Yep. Yeah, yeah. What, do you, what do you think about the rallies, coming to the rallies? Well, we love the rallies. Mm -hmm. We yeah. definitely love the rallies. Yeah, they're uh, fun. Get to meet a lot of people. Like mm -hmm. family reunions, we always say. Mm -hmm. It's like yes. people that you don't see for a while, and yeah. then yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. hanging out, meeting new people, too. Then after three days, you're tired of them, you want to leave. <laughs> That's when it's you better <laughs> than a family reunion. Right, you actually want to see these people. You don't have to send them a Christmas card. Exactly right. That's so funny. Yep. We love them. All right. I hope you enjoyed the uh, the tour of Marine and Miguel's uh, camper. They got a really nice set. They pull with a Tacoma pickup truck, so they got plenty of power here to mm -hmm. do oh, what yeah. they need to do. So, mm -hmm. and we're trying to get them up to Indiana. So hopefully you'll That's see right. them again in other videos. That's yeah. awesome. for sure. Yeah. Hey, this is my good friend Kathleen, and she's well known in the Runaway Group as Ladybug. Yes, I have bunches and bunches of fans. <laughs> <laughs> so we have actually videoed the inside of her camper before, but I want to show you guys because she has a four by eight, so this one's four foot wide. And uh, it's great for um, actually couples. There's a lot of couples that have yeah, these too, a but a uh, perfect for a single person uh, yeah. actually. So, uh, if you're a couple, you really have to like each other. That's right. Yeah. How long have you had your runaway? Uh, since the end of 2017. Oh, so, so she's a yeah. seasoned veteran. Yeah, coming up on six years. Did you buy this new? Yes. Oh, nice. Yes, I did at, nice. at the time when I could have driven one off the lot instead yeah. of waiting six months. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, yeah. Now they're very popular. So, yeah. anyway, she's a legend in the runaway camper world. She hits all the rallies and uh, is well known. Take a look inside her camper. I think you really like it. Yeah. yeah. What do you use the block for? Do you? Oh, that's to extend my bed at oh, night because okay. I that's... made it a tent intentionally that short, mm -hmm. and I could do it with that. Mm -hmm. But this is the part I cut off of the foam mattress. Okay. So I just kept it and those two benches down there. Okay. I set them up at night down here and put this foam on top. It brings it up to here and gives me a number oh, gives 18. You, okay. But that way during the day I have access to my I stuff see, up here. I see. It's not in the way. So yeah, you can see that uh, she's got a nice little setup here. She's got her drawers and her fairy lights on the ceiling. And uh, like she was saying, she's got... She can flip the, uh, put the bed out and make it longer if she wants because, uh, you know, she's a giant. Yes, all of five foot <laughs> all, giant. Yeah. All of five foot. So um, anyway, she can uh, put her thing out there. So this is really nice. She's got it set up really nice and it tows well behind her Honda oh, yeah. you don't even CRV. Know there. So yeah. yeah, and like I said, it's really expanded a lot of things in her life. It's been it made it really nice to meet new people and travel around. So. Yep. And you meet the nicest people in the runaway rallies. It's the nicest people in the runaway rallies. Mm -hmm. Yes. I yeah. don't know of anybody I could say I, I just had a dislike for. Everybody's been <laughs> Every, really friendly. Everybody's really good. Yeah. And the good thing about it is that if you do run into somebody that you didn't like, you're moving on in a couple of days. <laughs> <laughs> Say adios. <laughs> oh, although we have not had that happen. No, so. <laughs> no. That's, that's why we come to these yeah, rallies. Yeah. We get to see everybody that we've made friends with over the years, and it's just like a family reunion. Hey, what's the farthest rally you've been to? Uh, Pennsylvania. Ah, oh, I yeah. see that right here, Winfield, Pennsylvania. Yeah, I've been up there a couple of times now, and I'll be going back in August. Mm -hmm. So that's a little two-day trip, so I'll mm -hmm. overnight on the way. Mm -hmm. uh, but Kevin up there in Northeast, our yeah. RCO, he puts on a very good, he and Lisa. So RCO stands good. for the Runaway Camper Owners. Right. Runaway so there's uh, groups across the United States. Mm -hmm. And you can join all of those on Facebook and yep. you can attend any rally that you that you so pleased to attend. So mm -hmm. uh, it's fun to meet. For, look meet. for the events. Yeah, yes. yeah. Yes. yeah. And you're, you'll be welcome. So, all right, Kathleen, thanks for showing us your camper. Well, really you're appreciate so it. welcome, Ed. So nice seeing you and Nancy back from your big journeys. Yeah, well, one Alaska. Day. And one day. <laughs> there you go. Run up to Alaska. It'd be fun. So, all righty, let's move on down the road. All right. Okay, thank we're you. down here with the best setup. In, in the campground, <laughs> I think. So we really like um, Ron and Carla's setup here. They've got a gr green machine. What do you guys call it? Gam Gamora. Gamora. This is Gamora. So they've got an awesome setup here with a, what, what year's your, your so 2019 Jeep JLU Sport. 
there you know what he said yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I really like their setup and uh, I have some serious envy but uh, God has given me grace and, <laughs> and, and I and I'm happy with the old Astro van but I really like this uh, setup so yeah. we thought we'd uh, show you what they've got going on here so Hey, there's something that's pretty interesting. Oh, they're from Arkansas yes. too. So, yes. and you guys seen that? Uh, they have the uh, Arky leather on Instagram and and everything. So, some of their leather products. You've seen them in our videos before, yeah. but uh, they got a really good setup here. What do you guys got on the back of your camper here? That uh, a little sticker that it's important. Oh, 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 oh look! <laughs> One of our friends from hanging with Herky gave us a Chicken Alaska sticker. Carla's so a big chicken person. I am. And uh, when we were in Chicken Alaska this year, we bought a sticker and we sent it special delivery Yay! back to Carla. And there's the other sticker hanging with Herky hanging right with here. Herky. So, <laughs> all right, let's take a look at their setup. I think you really like it. Oh, so here's our cooking area. This is where I cook. So this is a cook partner stove. This is an incredible stove. It's better than we have in our house by far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I just cooked breakfast. And then my refrigerator's right here. And so our cook partner goes right under there when we store it. And then our little propane. Oh, my oven, I love. It can they make got cinnamon rolls and cinnamon biscuits rolls. and yeah. everything in there. Yeah. Biscuits so. and gravy yesterday. Yep, uh, we did. And they've got a, a canopy over the top. Yeah. Uh -huh. it, this is an... Alucam awning. It is an incredible awning. It, it stands up to the weather, mm -hmm. and we've been in, to, in some pretty, pretty significant storms with mm -hmm. it. And uh, it'll keep you dry. Yeah. And uh, it takes about a minute or so. It just it so, really sets up easy. Yeah. And uh, we love that thing. It's one of the best purchases mm -hmm. we had. Hey, let me step back and I'll show you their Jeep now. Um, they they stand out going down the highway we passed by them uh just the other day and it, i had to get uh, get get ahead there so we could wave at them but boy isn't their rig really nice kind of nice mojito green mojito green about that there's gamora on the dash up there you want to okay see yeah it's from guardians of the galaxy oh they got gamora from guardians of the galaxy <laughs> and there's Really nice. Look at their different patches they've got up. We we really like great rig and great couple. We really like it. Let's go back here and take a look at your your runaway camper. Yeah. We love it. Oh, well, here's our queen size bed. It's called the cabin. Our ventress is so kind of decorated it in a cabin type theme. And you've got the LED lights. Uh, yep. In across the top. Right. I like the little uh, corner. My husband made that. Ron made that for nice, it. Nice, nice. Yeah, we the... don't have anything permanently attached to the wall at all. This is a gorilla tape. Gorilla. Okay. <laughs> so we just taped Stick it to the it wall. In there. there you go. And, nice. Uh, it's. We watched the many of the videos that you did uh -huh. uh, on previous walk arounds when we were. Uh, selecting hours mm -hmm. and kind of watched how different people made the beds or different things and how they set it up and then we this is, this is what came, took it came up with it. Right. yeah yep. nice of course they had the back door Nancy's jealous she likes the back yes. door so like we were saying before this is a Ventress model so it's got uh, a little bit heavier suspension and mm -hmm. uh, the, the what's hitch. your axle it's it's got the Timbron uh, axleless uh -huh. suspension, the independent suspension. Yeah, it's an off-road model, yeah. mm -hmm. and uh, and it, it 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 handles real well. Nice, really like it. Nice. So I'm going to give them a break because the rain has just started, and they're That's standing okay. in the rain. No, and, we're good. <laughs> we're good. And and I'm going to pan around here and show you. I'll go to the other side, uh, guys, and you can see the the front yeah, of it. Got it all set up. Uh, really sweet. I I think it's good. They've got. Is that uh, the wood grain in the back is that paneling or is that contact? no it's just uh contact wallpaper, paper, contact oh, wallpaper. Oh, nice so um, we did that uh the shelf mm -hmm. uh, i'm i built mm -hmm. made and we added the shelf mm -hmm. and that comes in handy looks uh, looks nice now the the bed frame we just bought a cheap metal bed frame. metal bed frame had mm -hmm. to saw about six inches off of the end mm -hmm. and 
um, then we've got storage underneath that we use mm -hmm. um, and a pretty nice little it's a queen short mattress and um, we had to cut a couple inches cut a little off bit of off. it yeah. kind of like you showed us yeah. how to do it and uh, it worked well good deal you can see up on top they got a rhino rack uh, rack up on top for their gear and they got all their toys sitting out back <laughs> So I want the kayaks and the bikes. Yeah. Pretty cool. Pretty cool setup. They, I really like their setup. They've got a, get done a nice job, and you can see that uh, it's got the hitch from from the uh, on the Ventress model. Very nice. It's There's the Max Coupler. Max Coupler. And it it um, has a 360 degree articulation mm -hmm. and then for safety uh, uh when we're at the house i just pull that out then there's nothing it's to impossible for somebody to yeah and uh the the chains they come loose mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. the, and then i put the lock in so nobody could really stick anything in it mm -hmm. and uh, then we have uh that p-wag chain mm -hmm that i'll lock the axle with so there you go it's pretty secure it a good there you go so this one is uh ventress number 96. 96 so there you go okay that's ron and carla's setup i hope you enjoyed it because we really like it a lot yes thank you so, thank they you. have all the goodies <laughs> we have a jackery there you go. <laughs> That's a running joke is Nancy always wanted one of those little jackeries and they have one and we don't. <laughs> oh, I won one, but Ed gave it away. So. <laughs> I am not bitter. Uh, all righty. And hey. they have a back door. All right, we're going to move on. Uh, thanks for taking a look at this, but thank you guys for You're showing welcome. us the campers. Thank you. Welcome. And thank you. thank you for doing these videos oh, because we you. learned a lot and it helped us a lot when we were going through the process. Yeah. Good. And uh, we love the trailer and then the people. Are, and the family. Yes. I know. It's, I know. it's Wonderful. been Wonderful. really special. Yeah, last mm -hmm. night was fun. It's yeah. been a great time. We've had a good time here and at the tonight's rally. And tonight's the potluck. Yes. We're dodging the raindrops today, yeah. but uh, everybody's, the umbrella. We're everybody's good. in good spirits, so yeah. we're good. All righty, let's move on down the road. The last camper and our tour campers and uh, I say that because uh, Runaway is telling me that you know once upon a time the Range Runner was the most popular model for many years but they have had a big influx of people wanting rousers so this is a rouser this is a composite uh, these folks bought this camper in January and they've done a superb job at modifying it I want to take you inside and you can take a look around I think you'll agree with me They've got uh, an ARB uh, awning and a hanging tent. It's it's similar to the one that we own, uh, but they do have a small changing tent off to the side here uh, that you know you can put a bathroom in or just use to change. But uh, it's uh, it's it's really nice. I want I want to point out something. Um, they have snaps all around the door here, so they have cut this. Uh, this is something I really want to do to our camper too, is to put these snaps in here so th this makes this pretty weather resistant. But come inside and take a look at what they've done. It's really neat. I'm going to turn the camera around so you can see. So as you walk in, you can just see that this, this is quality. They've done just a really good job. They have two beds. It's a couple and they have two beds. And uh, one, let me show you something is on the beds, they've got these trays that come out and at nighttime they can pull those out uh, to extend the bed and give it give it some an extension so that it's long enough they're both six foot uh, so uh, it helps with the you know with the length of the bed uh, most of the stuff that they have is they just bought from Walmart as far as furniture goes the the uh, the the shelf there but the bed they made themselves I want to show you something here that I think is really interesting so if you raise this up if you raise this up I'm gonna try to do this one-handed here so bear with me if you raise this up you can access this and sometimes they put their their toilet in here or they got their dirty clothes in there now uh, I think this is really clever uh, the way they've got this set up but take a look around this is a composite 
uh, runaway and uh, they've done a really good job at attaching things um, these cabinets they got from Walmart they got that set up you can see they've got a powered pump on that one there with a the sink and then the refrigerator and of course air conditioner and the whole works wow i i think uh they've done a, just a great job i can't say enough good thing and they're very nice people and i thank them for letting me uh show you take a look around the i didn't feel comfortable being on camera but i think uh i think you can appreciate it so Hey, if you like these campers, make sure you uh, leave a comment below what, uh, about what you think about the the, uh, the Rouser. It's quickly becoming very popular, and uh, I, I like it. And boy, what a great job they've done. So I just want to say thanks for showing me the camper. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope uh, it helps you make a decision on what mods you want to do. Or if you're looking at, you know, buying a runaway camper, I think this will help. Uh, seeing so we looked at the cool camp the range runner and a rouser and several different uh, configurations so alrighty I'm gonna get back up to the camper and catch back up with Nancy I just ran down here but hope you Do enjoyed you see it. what I see yes there's two herkies here except for this one is a female and her name is Annie <laughs> they look almost like this but is she's a shih tzu right that is correct okay all right and we have the Lhasa Apsu this obviously. is our this is our friend John he owns a runaway and uh, we've seen him quite a few times at different runaway rallies but this He's is the first from Kansas <laughs> it was the first time correct. we met our was little about, Annie was, little Annie. Annie there we go yes me <laughs> what do you think there's two herkies out she's, there she's keeping an eye that herky stays his distance <laughs> Well, as the sun sets on Persimmon Hill Campground on Lake Enid, the rally comes to an end, and uh, we've had a really good time. So it's Sunday night, and most of the people have left. There's a few people still hanging around. Everybody's hooked on, though, and they'll be out of here in the morning. So much, so everybody's ready so much so that Nancy already took a shower and got ready for bed and is dressed in her night clothes so it's up to me to end the video so um i hope you enjoyed it i hope you enjoyed the tour of our campers and see what everybody does we took a little bit different spin this time mainly focus on the runaway camper and not what's going on on the rally but uh we met a lot of new people and uh got to reconnect with a lot of older folks I, older friends I should say <laughs> and uh, it's been a blast I didn't see uh, uh, Terry and Pam down there walking by the lake with their dog uh, it's been great here so hey I hope you enjoyed our video and um, if you like our videos uh, just like uh, comment and subscribe they say and we appreciate it until next week we'll see you later